my amiable students today i have kept three african writers and i will elaborately explain you about them in my previous videos i had talked over about six african writers but today i am going to explain you about three african writers they are ben okri elichi amodi aikui arma aikui arma so which are indispensable for your obvious digital english let's discuss about them ben okri ben okri was a nigerian poet and a novelist ben okri was a nigerian poet and a novelist he was born on 15 march in 1959 in minna in nigeria understood so ben okri ben okri he was a nigerian poet and a novelist he was born on 15 march in 1959 in minna in nigeria he had also came to our country in jaipur understood he had come to india uh, towards jaipur while the literature festival was going on in 2019 on 24 to 28 january understood he had come here who ben okri let's go to know about his rewards how many rewards he had got throughout in his life so till now he is alive understood so till now how many rewards he had got so let's know till now how many rewards he has got main booker prize he had got in 1991 for his novel famis road understood he got main booker prize in 1991 for his novel famis road after that he also got commonwealth writers prize in 1987 and after that guardian fiction prize he had also got he also got a guardian fiction prize in 1988 for the novel star of the new curfew star of the new curfew let's go to know about his works flower of swords swords flower of swords uh, he had published in 1980 which was his first novel understood his first novel is flower of swords and it was published in 1980 and because of this for this novel uh ben okri he got uh, main booker prize in 1991 it was published in 1991 it was also a novel after that a way of being free a way of being free it was published in 1997 which was an essay star book star book was published in 2007 it was a novel and a time for new dreams it was published in 2011 and it was an essay a time for new dreams a time for new dreams so my lovable students i just discussed about ben okri and ben okri was a nigerian poet and a novelist he was born on 15 march in 1959 in minna in nigeria and he had also come to our country while the literature festival was going on in jaipur in 2019 on 24 to 28 january understood and i have already told you that he got main booker prize in 1991 for his novel famis rod famis rod you have to mug up mug up it commonwealth writers prize he got commonwealth writers prize in 1987 garden fiction prize he got in 1988 and he got garden fiction prize for his novel star of the new curfew if we consider his works like that flower of swords was published in 1980 which was his first novel and the famis road was published in 1991 and for this novel he got main booker prize in 1991 
A Way of Being Free was published in 1997, which was an essay. Star Book was published in 2007, which was a novel. A Time for New Dreams was published in 2011, which was an essay. So, my lovely students, let's go to know about Elichi Omadi. Elichi Omadi was also a Nigerian author. He was born on 12. Elichi Omadi was born on 12 May. 12 May in 1934. And he passed away on 29 June at Port Hancourt in Nigeria. Understood? He passed away on 29 June at Port Hancourt in Nigeria. If we consider about his works, The Concubine was published in 1966, which was his devout novel. Understood? He was, which was his devout novel. After that, The Great Points was published in 1969, which was a novel. Then, Sunset in Bipra. It was a, uh, an autobiographical novel. It was an autobiographical and it was published in 1973. After that, When God Came. When God Came was published. So, when did it publish? It has not mentioned. That's why I have also not mentioned here. And it was his last novel, When God, my lovely students, When God came. It was his last novel. Let's do revisit again. Elichi Omadi, he was a Nigerian author. He was born on 12 May in 1934. He passed away on 29 June at Port Hancourt, Nigeria. And if we consider about his works, The Concubine was published in 1966 and which was a Robert novel. Then after that, The Great Prince was published in 1969, which was a novel. Then Sunset by Pra was an autobiographical novel and it was published in 1973. And When God Came was his last creation and it was his last novel, When God Came. Let's know the last a writer, the last creator, the last author of African literature, which I have mentioned here, I Kui Arma. He was a Ghanaian author. He was born on 28 October in 1939, Takuradi in Ghana. He was born on 28 October in 1939, Takuradi in Ghana. Let's know about his works. The Beautiful of Ones Are Not Yet Born. It was published in 1968. 2000 Seasons was published in 1973. The Healers was published in 1979. In Fragments was published in 1970. Why Are We So Blast was published in 1972. Let's do revisit let's do revisit again what I have explicated on I Kui Arma. I Kui Arma. So I Kui Arma was an a Ghanaian author. Understood? He was born on 28 October in 1939 in Takoredi in Ghana. Understood? His works. The Beautiful Ones Are Not Yet Born was published in 1968. 2000 Seasons was published in 1973. The Healers was published in 1979. In Fragments was published in 1970. Why are We So Blast was published in 1972. So eventually my lovable students, I have kept 10 multiple choice questions on African literature. Let's we shall elaborate and discuss these 10 multiple choice questions on African literature. Question number one. Who was the youngest African writer to win Booker Prize? Who was the youngest African to win Booker Prize? Four options are mentioned here. And he's that great man. He got Booker Prize, Man Booker Prize for his novel Famous Rod in 1991. My lovely students, its correct option is option D. Ben Okri. 
Let's go to the question number two. What are the novels included in the Pamis Dot trilogy? The Pami What are the novels included in the Pamis Dot trilogy? Option A: The Pamis Dot. B: Songs of Enchantment. C: Infinite Riches. So its correct option is option D. All of the above. Let's go to question number three. Obi Okono is a character in. Obi Okono is a character in. Option A: Things fall apart. B: No longer at. No, it will be no. No longer at each. Era of God, the novelist as teacher. Its correct option is no longer at each. No longer at each. Option B. Obi Okan is a character in. No longer at each. Which creation it was? Obi or Ben Okri. Ben Okri. Let's go to question of question number four. Which African writer has won Nobel Prize for the first time? Which African writer has won Nobel Prize for the first time? Option A. Wolsenka. B. Ngugi Wathing. C. Chinua Achieve. D. None of these. Its correct option is option A. Wolsenka. Wolsenka. With the first African, understood, who had got Nobel Prize for the first time. Let's go to question number five. Which was the first African feminist text? Which was the first African feminist text? Option A. Incidents in the life of a slave girl. B. Twelve years a slave. C. The story of an African. D. In Arcadia form. So it was the creation of Olive Screener. My lovely students, take a glance on the correct answer. Its correct option is option C. The story of an African. Let's go to question number six. Which Nigerian writer is associated with Yoruba culture? Which African writer is associated with Yoruba culture? Option A. N. Gugi Watinge. B. Wal Sainka. C. Nadine Godimar. D. None of these. Take a glance on the correct option. Its correct option is option B. Also Inka. Let's go to question number 7. The purpose of writing is to keep my country alive. Who said? The purpose of, the purpose of writing is to keep my country alive. Who said? I am repeating this question again. The purpose of writing is to keep my country alive. Who said? Four options are mentioned here. Pick out the correct one. Option A. Nuruddin Farah. B. Chinua Achieb. C. Buchi M. Cheta. D. All of the above. My lovely students, pick out the correct one. Its correct option is option A. Nuruddin Farah. Let's go to question number eight. Identify the novel Farah's blood in the novel Son trilogy. Identify the novel in Paras Blood in the novel Son Trilogy. My lovable students, for our options are mentioned here, pick out the correct one. Gifts, option A, B, Maps, C, Secrets, D, all of the above. Its correct option is option D, all of the above. Let's go to question number 9. Identify the novels included in Paras Past Imperfect Trilogy. Identify the novels included in Farah's Fast Imperfect Trilogy. My lovable students, pick out the correct one. I have mentioned four options here and you have to pick out the correct one. Option A, links. B, notes. C, crossbones. D, all of the above. Its correct option is option D, all of the above. Understood? Let's go to the last question. Which African writer later became a Hindu? Which African writer later became a Hindu? But before he was Christian. Understood? Which African writer later become, become a Hindu? 
ऑप्शन ए बेनक्री बी नडेन गोडीमर सी बेसी हेड डी अम्मा अट्टा आईडू अम्मा अट्टा आईडू व्हिच अफ्रीकन राइटर लेटर बिकेम ए हिंदू मै लव विल स्टोर इट्स इट करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज ऑप्शन सी बेसी हेड बेसी हेड सो मै लव विल स्टोर इट्स कीप वाचिंग माय वीडियोस टू ब्रश अप योर नॉलेज ऑन इंग्लिश लिटरेचर थैंक्स अ लॉट मे गॉड ब्लेस यू हैव अ लवेबल लाइफ